What's up guys, Jeff. Crazy hand grows outside here. It's a early Thursday morning. Well, it's, it's like 8.30. It's not too early, but got my camera set up here. Uh, I'm trying to get some birds, um, but naturally, the second that this thing was in the way at first, so like I had a whole bunch of good shots, but that thing was right in the way, so it was like, fuck, um, ants all over this thing. I went and took it down, and now there hasn't been a single bird on there since, so I wasn't able to get a good photo. So, I was like, I'll just come film for you guys, because uh, I just uh, filmed a time-lapse segment on my on that camera out here, so I figured I'd, um, you know, do my normal thing, too. So, there's the soil conditioner in 707 I just put in here. Uh, it's basically going to be used for uh, most of my tomato starters, and then... Um, probably some cannabis starters. I don't know. I might just do 707 for the cannabis. I haven't decided yet. Um, because I still have that pot over there I can mess with for, like, just, you know, I could top it off with some of that stuff. And here is where we're at. Um, I just kind of wrapped some of this stuff around. Um, I hammered this one in. I kind of did it in between the bottom and the top so it's, you know, braces a little more that one in and then I didn't do this one in too hard just so I can pull it in and out and kind of get in here but hopefully this deters them a little bit if it doesn't I'm really gonna have to put some stuff over here but I am gonna go ahead and put three habaneros in here um, right after this I need to kind of get it wet um, there's my one little habanero left because uh, all the seedlings that like I didn't put into the solo cups that I took outside. If they um, made it a couple days, I just put them in here. But like I've lost one jalapeno and four habaneros in this thing, and that's the last survivor. Looks like there's something over there growing too. I don't really know what that is, but um, I mean there's stuff falling in this all the time. So we'll just see what happens with that. Uh, I might try and move it towards the middle a little more if it ends up taking pretty good. We'll see though. I don't know. It might be fine right there. I, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Um, but I just need to, that's where I'm going to put the habaneros. I'm going to do three in there. We'll just see how that goes. Um, they're pretty good size. So I put the snake there too just in case someone in Discord mentioned it. You know, I had, this one was actually just kind of sitting in the gazebo so I put it to work. Um, might get a few more as well. But them squirrels are smart man. They're probably just gonna climb right up the fence, doop to do, come right down in here. Um, so I'm probably still gonna have to try and cover them with something for the meantime until they get bigger. But they're starting to get pretty big in the tent, so I need to start bringing some out and see how they how they work. This is just kinda I don't know, you know, this is kind of my parents' deal, but I mentioned that to my mom. She's like, oh, I thought it was just all our stuff. And I was just like, I don't know. I had no plans to do anything with this. But now I guess I need to figure out what to do with it. Um, my dad said he was going to get some soil and put in here and mix it up with all this stuff. But, I mean, there's, like, grass growing in here. And I don't know. Uh, I don't mind helping. It's just I need to know what we're doing. I just, you know, I think she thought I had a plan or something for this, but I... I'm only messing with my kind of stuff over here, you know. And here's where I'll try and put some cannabis, too. Uh, I think I'm just going to do some of the Sunkiss crossed with Mimosa Gelato. And then some Granddaddy Purple. I might do one over there and a couple over here. We'll just see how that goes. That's kind of the last thing on my mind after the tomatillos and tomatoes. Um, we do have one little can of coming in over here. And sorry if I get cut off, y'all. I, I think I have enough space to... Right here, here's the can that's coming in. I mean, you can see the little shoots. They're kind of coming in all over the place. They'll be back in there. And they're really pretty, though. If you guys didn't see them last year, you'll see them again this year. It's a rose bush. Um, it's got some foliage coming back in, so hopefully we get some roses. Um, I might just recharge like a lot of this stuff out here occasionally just to help a little bit 
And the good old strawberries are killing it. They're already flowering and they're just, you know, praying to the sun. I topped them off that 707. Uh, I haven't really watered them once, but I'm about to start watering stuff more regular. But they're doing really good. I'm really glad they came back. Um, you know, so there's a few more little dead stuff in here I can pull out. But, but that's what we're doing, guys. Um, I'll check back with you here later or a couple days or something. We'll see. But much love and take it easy. What's up, y'all? Jeff. You know, crazy and gross. I'm gonna try this new camera out here. Um, I'm just kind of getting some stuff ready. I think I'm gonna plant a few of the habaneros this morning. Um, I'm trying to get some chicken wire over there to cover it, just kind of janky until I get some like two by fours put in the ground to kind of make it more like a, a pepper cage, maybe. Um, and uh, get that looking a little better. But I'm gonna get out here, I need to throw some soil over here, work around. So I'll probably just let this thing run um, until it runs out and uh, do some like time lapse stuff or, you know, just show me work I'm putting into music. So I hope you guys enjoy. my old crazy dog everybody I know I go get a hammer uh, man well, what's up guys good morning Jeff crazy hand grows out here in the backyard um, jalapeno or habaneros been out here a couple days um, it's been kind of cold man um, so they've been kind of real deep but hopefully it starts warming up and they get uh, they're doing better. It's still got my little one in here. Um, 
my little trial run, so it looks like it's got like a little bit of growth on it, so we'll see what happens. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put some jalapenos over in this one today. Um, they've been outside for, I've been slowly transitioning them out here, two hours, four hours, then eight hours. Um, so, you can see all this red stuff on here, it's cayenne. Um, it's just the only thing I've been able to do to really keep the squirrels and birds from fucking pecking in the soil. Um, so, kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Um, but, just gonna give you guys an update with this stuff while I was out here. Um, I'm gonna try and get the uh, poblanos done in this one. And I'm bringing some out this morning. So, everything's getting pretty big in the tent. So. I'll try and film over there here for you in just a second. What's up, guys? Sorry about this video. It's kind of all over the place. Um, I'm a little bit behind on the uh, outdoor things footage, um, so I'm probably just going to drop a couple episodes in a row, and I don't have too much uh, Arise footage really left, so what I'll probably do is just... Uh, do some outdoor content mostly until I can get my next grow going so um and that should be soon I just today is February 26th um or April 26th um so April 26th and that last segment I just edited was like April 11th or something so it was two weeks ago and this video probably won't even come out for another week so um but yeah, I'm trying, y'all. I'm trying to get this. I've been real busy lately. Things have been kind of crazy, but bear with me. I got the room done today. I'm tired. I had to do some repotting on the yellow pear tomatoes, a whole bunch of stuff. But I want to say thank you all for that. Uh, those that are, you know, staying with me, bearing with me through everything. Um, much love. Sorry, like this video is all over the place, but kind of want to give you a little update. Next video is going to be, um, start off for like April 15th. I, I know I still was going to go indoors and show you everything, but it's just been crazy. I've just been trying to film when I can and put stuff together when I can. And, but much love to everybody that, uh, has been staying, um, true and still liking everything, commenting for me. I really appreciate the support. I'm almost at 200 subscribers. I've been like almost 190 and then I'll lose a few and then I'll get a couple more and lose a few. And it's just, so I've been right around 185, 190 for last month or so, but it ain't no thing. I do it for fun, but, you know, more followers leads to maybe sponsors or more things that for me to do in the industry. I have a lot of things coming up kind of in the personal um, in the industry I'm working in. So hopefully it's just, uh, just a matter of time. And I'm letting things work out. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to shut up. And I'll see y'all later.